All right, fast foodies, I hope this review doesn't get too cheesy. What is going on everyone? Hope y'all are having a great day whenever you're watching today's fast food review. That's right, today we're gonna be indulging in some classic American fast food from the one and only KFC. Why are we gonna be having KFC today? Well, because KFC just came out with, I think just one, one new, no, maybe a few more, but today we're gonna be trying one of the new fast food items that KFC just came out. The brand new mac and cheese wrap to be exact. This is obviously a new take on their wraps. I think they have two uh, two original ones. They, I was looking at the menu. I think they have like a classic one and some type of spicy slaw one. But most recently, they did come out with a mac and cheese version of their wraps. And I hope it's going to be pretty good because this honestly, it looks like one of those rolled chicken tacos you can get at Taco Bell. And those only cost like a dollar. This costs three dollars. So it's three times as expensive as something that looks very similar at Taco Bell. Speaking of Taco Bell, they also came out with, not KFC, Taco Bell came out with some loaded fries. I think like steak fries, something like that. If you wanna see a review of those, then there's two things you gotta do. Leave a comment in the description box below. And second, hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on when, if I review those fries, although, I think the Taco Bell location nearest to me recently closed. So I'm gonna have to do some research to find out where the second nearest one is. But honestly, there's a Taco Bell on every corner nowadays, so it shouldn't be that hard. But back to what we're gonna be trying today. It's pretty much just uh, a wrap featuring the classic KFC fried chicken. And there's some, um, you guys can kind of see mac and cheese in the bottom there. Now I asked the guy, who took my order if this is any good or not. And he said, man, I gotta be honest with you, I haven't had it. So yeah, kind of going into this blind, but come on. Fried chicken, mac and cheese. I have a hard time believing that this won't be at least average. Make sure to stay tuned to the end of this review. I'm gonna be having some bonus footage. You can be bringing on a special guest to help me out. So um, yeah, let's give this a bite. I'll go in right here where the crunchy chicken is. It's pretty good. Good amount of mac and cheese. Not surprisingly, KFC did the chicken well. It's crunchy. The inside of the chicken is nice and juicy, moist. The one thing that's kind of missing from this, it's a little bit of a, I wish I had some sauce, some barbecue sauce, maybe a little bit of a hot sauce, maybe a little seasoning. No, they need some sauce, you know, or maybe some mayo even. Just a little bit of sauciness to help complement that mac and cheese and chicken. But yeah, honestly, not bad. It is a little pricey, I think for $3. I could see maybe like $2, $2.50. That'd be, I think, a bit more um, deserving price for this mac and cheese wrap. But yeah, flavor-wise, texture-wise, not bad. Mom, you wanna give it a try? And there's two types of cheeses. There's the uh, mac and cheese, and there's, I think, cheddar cheese on top. You can't really see. Cut a piece if you want. Mm -hmm. It's a fan. Mac and cheese wrap. Oh, that's a good cross section. Look mm -hmm. at that, yeah. You can see. So yeah, it's definitely, it's, oh, it's like surrounded by mac and cheese. I don't, I don't need to have the wrap. <laughs> just the mac and cheese. Yeah, honestly, yeah, that, yeah, if they, because I know they serve mac and cheese. So they, I'm not sure if they serve, they maybe, they may have that actually, just like mac and cheese mixed with chicken. I think that'd be, yeah, good. But yeah, not bad, it's easy. Quick little snack, so. Bit salty. Hmm? Bit salty. Bit salty? Salty. That's from the chicken, I think. The chicken mm -hmm. is a, yeah. But yeah, overall, I think, uh, I don't know, I think it's seven and a half. Seven and a half out of ten. Mm. Yeah. Um, yeah, nothing spectacular. That's good, but 
If it was a little cheaper, I could see myself giving this an eight, but because it is pricey. And if it had some sauce, it's something like barbecue sauce mm -hmm. or something like that. Yeah, but at the end of the day, not a bad option. I'll catch you guys in the next one. If you made it to the end of this video, then I'm sure that you want to become a fast foodie as well. So all you have to do is hit that subscribe button. And to see exclusive behind the scenes footage, then you can head on over to Instagram and follow the fast foodies at fast foodies review.